The functions of our body are ensured by specialized organs that maintain a constant balance, called homeostasis, that keeps us healthy. Organs are made and maintained by cells. Proteins are the main functional components of the cells, so the structure and functions of cells, organs, and of the whole body mostly boil down to quality and quantity control of proteins. When a protein becomes damaged, non-functional, or misfolded, it must be degraded by the ubiquitin proteasome system, or UPS, to keep homeostasis. Ubiquitin is a signaling polypeptide. The protein that needs to be degraded is tagged with a chain of four ubiquitin elements, thanks to a three-step enzymatic reaction, and then shuttled to the proteasome. E3 ligases are the enzymes that specifically recognize the target proteins to tag. The proteasome is a cylindrical complex with a gate that recognizes and removes the polyubiquitin chain and a core that degrades tagged proteins into small peptides and amino acids. Deubiquitinating enzymes, or DUBs, are responsible for the specific removal of ubiquitin from tagged proteins, meaning their recycling. The UPS is not just the waste management of the cell, but a key regulator of proteins levels. Its deregulation is implicated in many diseases, including cancers or neurodegenerative disorders. USP7 is the dub that stabilizes MDM2 and rescues it from degradation by the proteasome. MDM2 is an oncoprotein responsible for the deregulation of the cell cycle and overexpressed in many cancers, such as sarcoma and leukemia. An enhanced USP7 activity favors MDM2 accumulation in cell, anormal cell proliferation, and transformation into tumoral cell. Inhibitors of USP7 are therefore good anti-cancer drug candidates. Another example is Parkinson disease, a disorder characterized by the aggregation of alpha-synuclein in Lewy bodies in dopaminergic neurons. USB-8 is the dub that deubiquinates and prevents the degradation of alpha-synuclein. The accumulation of alpha-synuclein favors its aggregation. Inhibiting USP8 could contribute to reduce the pathological accumulation of acynuclein in diseased neurons. Hybrogenics has pioneered the research on inhibitors of USP7 or USP8. This strategy is the focus of Hybrogenics drug discovery activity.